Hey there, this is James Wilson with BJJ Strength Training Systems and BJJStrengthTraining.com. Today I want to share a really great mobility exercise that will help open up your hips, especially if they're tight from doing a lot of uh, closed guard or you know, triangles, things that really have you focusing on, on squeezing with the thighs and, and you get like this you know, inner thigh and the hips get tight from that. This exercise will really, really, really help with that. So uh, the, it's called the frog. A stretch, uh, also known as the lion pose or something like that in some circles. So you may have seen this before, but I got a couple things that you may not have seen that'll help you get a little bit more out of it. So to do this, to get started, you definitely want to have some sort of padding underneath your, your knees and your feet. You're going to get your knees spread out pretty much about as wide as you can. You know, you don't want it to be completely uncomfortable. It's going to get uncomfortable quickly. So, you know, we're not trying to do the splits here, just getting to where you're starting to feel like, okay, that's getting a little tight there. And now, what you're going to do, you got your hands planted, you want your head up, you're going to puff your chest out, and then what you're going to do is you're going to pull your butt back towards your heels, and then you're going to come back forward. And then you pull your butt back, and then you come back forward. So, I'll show you from the side so you can see how this is looking. And this will help. So you'll see that I'm starting neutral. And then I'm going to pull my butt back towards my heels. And then I'm going to come back. And then I pull my butt back towards my heels. And then I come back. Couple things, keep your chest puffed out. Good tight arch in your low back. Good strong uh, chest position. Keep your head up. As you're coming back, you don't want to lose that. You can't allow yourself to start rounding or arching or looking down. And you can also uh, Im improve this a little bit by driving with your palms. So you want to pull your butt towards your heels, but you can also push with your palms into the ground and that'll help stabilize the upper body a little bit and help you get a little deeper into that. So I like to do, I mean, really anywhere from like five to 10 of those. And then here's a little twist you may not have seen before. When you're done, you're going to extend one leg out you're going to sit back on your heel in this position here. So you can reach out if you can, and grab that toe, really feel the stretch opening up here in the inner thigh area. And then again, coming back to the beginning, stretch out the other leg and then coming back. Again, good posture, nice and tall, good strong chest position. You know, when you're leaning over here, think about more about trying to bring your belly button down towards the ground than just leaning your upper body and chest over. And that'll really help make sure you're stretching out the hip and the, and the hamstring there. And so, and then when you're done, just coming up. You wanna come out of this nice and easy. Stand on up, shake it off. So, there you go. There's the frog stretch. Uh, again, one of my favorite ones. I do this one a bunch. Because again, really helps open things up. Uh, you know, I personally do a lot of closed guard at this point, just trying to survive on the bottom. And so uh, when that gets tight, it's a great one to open that up and uh, make sure that I'm moving well, both on and off the mat. So that's what's important. So anyways, once again, this has been James Wilson with BJJ Strength Training Systems. You can check me out on the web at bjjstrengthtraining.com. If you got any questions or comments about this, please feel free to visit me there and, and post them there. I'll get to them as soon as I can. And I'll talk to you next time.